Hey everybody, uh, this is Sal and uh, this is another uh, tech tutorial. Uh, today uh, you're going to be uh, learning how to install Ubuntu 10.04 onto a netbook. Okay, and the reason why I'm making this video is because my netbook here doesn't have a CD-ROM tray. So there are some of you out there that may be scratching their heads saying, how can I install my Ubuntu uh, from a CD um, onto my netbook which does not have a CD-ROM player as you can see here and uh, I'm gonna show you right now uh, pretty much I'm just gonna dictate it it's really simple to do you can just I'll have the instructions in the show notes um, but I'm just gonna show you some visuals just to make the video a little entertaining so the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna download uh, you're gonna download Ubuntu 10.04 Netbook Edition. Okay, so all you gotta do is just go to the main homepage here, Ubuntu 10.04. Right at halfway through the page, you're gonna see right there. You're gonna see d download Ubuntu 10.04 Netbook Edition. You're gonna download the ISO. You're gonna burn it to CD. Okay, leave it in your CD-ROM tray on your PC. Okay and navigate to the file folder or just navigate explore the disk and there's a file there's a, a file called USB dash creator okay that application is gonna help you create a bootable USB key and install um, Ubuntu 10.04 onto your netbook without a CD-ROM. So the whole point is to pop, is to turn this USB key into a bootable key with Ubuntu 10.04 installer on it. Okay, so where did we leave off? So you got the files burned to CD. You're gonna open up USB-Creator, okay, and I'll do that myself right now. Windows 7 is giving me a warning. Let's zoom in if we can. Whoops, sorry about that. So there's two main windows in this startup disk application, USB creator application. Top half detects the CD uh, the the Ubuntu CD in your CD-ROM okay the second window at the bottom should detect your USB key okay now let me add it helps if you format your USB key if you format it just fat file system fat 16 give it a quick format and you're good okay so you've got as long as you see the CD-ROM in the top window and your memory key in the bottom window you're good. We're going to zoom on a little bit there. There's two radio buttons at the bottom of this application. One says stored in reserve space and the second is discarded on shutdown unless you have unless you save them elsewhere. Select the second uh, button if you select the first one like I did the first time around, I got into a lot of mount errors when trying to uh, install it. Select discarded on shutdown unless you save them elsewhere and then click make startup disk. All right? That's going to take a few minutes, 5 to 10 minutes depending on the speed of your USB key. Once you get the warning or the update that the formatting the uh, the startup disk has completed you've you're ready to you're ready to take your disk yeah your USB key and pop it in your um, netbook so we're gonna quickly just pop our key into our CD ROMless netbook so you pop the key in and then just turn it on
and make sure in the BIOS you have it set to uh, U, um, USB port to boot up. So our first selection is try Ubuntu, the second selection is install. Just select install and um, it'll just start installing a program without a CD-ROM. And it'll give you the netbook edition as well, obviously. Alright, it's very simple, it's very straightforward. Um, so if you have if you like if you have a netbook that doesn't have a CD-ROM tray, you've got no um, there's no obstacles in your way. Just create a bootable USB key, pop it in the uh, USB port on your netbook, and away you go. Hopefully, it's been clear and straightforward, and uh, we'll see you next time. Ciao for now.